Hey, what's going on, everybody? So here's a doomsday scenario for you. Uh, there is an interview that I'm going to let you guys listen to in a moment where John Lynch was asked at the combine by Matt Mayoka if there is a possibility in a financial way that the 49ers could, in fact, bring back Jimmy Garoppolo next year. And uh, you'll be surprised at the answer that John Lynch gives. Um, let's just say that it's news that most Niners fans don't want to hear, um, especially ones that are ready to move on from Garoppolo. So I'll let the sound clip play for you guys. And then you let me know down in the comments what you think about that whole situation. And <laughs> uh, it, it definitely caught me off guard and it probably will catch you guys off guard too. So let me know down in the comments below what you guys think. And until next time, I'll see you guys on the flip side. Bye everyone. Do you think Jimmy Garoppolo's situation with uh, requiring the surgery on his throwing shoulder, does that impact a date of when there's finality with Jimmy Garoppolo's uh, situation as it pertains to the 49ers and whatever other teams might be interested in? Yeah, I think that's for other teams. Um, but, you know, I, I, I think that, uh, you know, there's there's obviously avenues open if, if we give permission. They can talk to the doctors. So I think it might cause for a little more due diligence. But, but you're right. Um, a new league year, wanting to set your team, and, and obviously that's a critical spot. Um, you know, usually forces action uh, this time of year. And the combine is a, you know, it's it's set up just perfectly because we're all here together. And so, you know, those meetings take place. And like I said, we, we will listen. We also know that we've got a, a really good quarterback in Jimmy. And so if we have the two of them again and let them go compete, then we're happy to do that as well. And we're capable of doing that with our cap. Even with, you don't need the, the $25 million, uh, you know, to do the things that you want to do as far as Lakin Tomlinson, DJ Jones, <laughs> you know, uh, not only, you know, Dre Greenlaw and Aziz Alshire, not to mention Debo Samuel and Nick Bose. There are certainly trade-offs, but we've budgeted for a lot of different things with plan A, with plan B, plan C, and, and one of those scenarios, and you know, a couple different of those scenarios has included Jimmy. And so, yes, we can do it. It will curtail what we're able to do, the aggressiveness we have in free agency. The bottom line is, whatever that combination is, we want to be a better football team or give ourselves an opportunity to be a better football team going into next year.